Are you dying to quit smoking? This year, 430,000 people will quit by dying. Right now, we can easily help you quit smoking. Well, today I <clears throat> got a chance to play with Craig there. Uh, sorry, Craig. Uh, Freddie and then um, Jim joined us on the 13th hole. And it was uh, just a, what a great day today. Um, coming into today, I didn't know what to, uh, what to expect um, with regards to reception and I tell you what, the, the galleries couldn't be nicer. I mean, it was just incredible. And uh, the encouragement that I got, and it was just, it, it, it blew me away, to be honest with you. It really did. And, um, you know, the, the people here over the years, I know they're the, extremely respectful, but today was just uh, something that, that really touched my heart pretty good. Um, and also, I'd like to, I guess, um, make uh, another little comment um, before we start. I know that uh, the players over the past few months have been bombarded by questions by all of you and uh, the public as well. And I'd like to uh, tell all the players, um, hopefully after today, after answering questions at this press conference, that the players can be left alone to focus on the Masters and focus on their game, not only for this week, but uh, going forward as well. And I uh, certainly apologize to all of them for having to endure what they've had to endure the past few months. Um, a lot has happened uh, in my life over the past five months. And um, I'm here at the Masters to play and compete. And I'm um, just really excited about, about doing that. And I missed the competition. I miss seeing the guys out here. A lot of my friends I haven't seen in a while. Um, it was great to play golf with again with Freddie and Jim, two of my my best friends out here. And I played with with Mark uh, yesterday for nine holes, and I'm playing with him again tomorrow, as well as uh, uh, Steve Stricker. So it, uh, it's been just an incredible experience so far here at the Masters.